And welcome to another video and it's Sunday the 5th of October 2023 15 Celsius 59 Fahrenheit it's gonna be a beautiful day it's pretty warm we have decided to come to Nantwich car parking completely free on a Sunday which is really good start off at church yard side so we invite you to join us on this wonderful walk around Nantwich Hopefully as the church bells, good timing. Never been to Nantwich before. Apparently there are some really old, unique buildings. Let's go and take a look. Pretty impressive church here at Nantwich. Got the five times zoom on here with the iPhone. Amazing how they built these places. Well, this place used to be but AD 1867 a little church door there well, that's the oldie witchy theatre witchy theatre 1919 looks to be a lot to see here in Nantwich Navio lounge cafe and bar right by the entrance to the church Quite a few people in them, in there already. This must have been uh, an old bank, I guess. That would have been Barclays before. So this is TSB, still TSB. To the left is going to be the town square and the museum. Some beautiful flowers. 1939 to 1945. Men of Nantwich who fell in the Great War. Second Lieutenant Stanley. Bowie, Royal Scots Fusiliers, 1st December 1917. Award winning floral town supporting Britain in bloom. Beautiful picture there. Let's check out the, uh, the old buildings here. Absolutely spectacular. Absolutely loving this building. It's like something like Little Morton Hall, all over the place. Beautiful. It's currently 9:52 a.m. Everyone's waiting for the shops to open. Probably about 10 or 11 a.m. Queen's Aid House rebuilt after the Great Fire of 1583. That's an amazing building, isn't it? Wow. Beautiful areas to sit there. And just check this building out. That's absolutely awesome. There is just streets going everywhere here in Nantwich. And just beautiful shops like that. So wow. What's going on in Nantwich at the moment? Stone Roses, December. 80s parties, Santa's sparkly surprise. I'm flat sure where any of these streets really lead. Look at this building, look at the detail on that one. Beautiful. Very impressed with, uh, with Nantwich. Nantwich, beautiful place to come to. Very clean. I'm not seeing an empty shop at the moment. So this part of town, there's uh, authentic Thai cuisine, dental, lots and lots of shops. Don't know my way around Nantwich, so we're just having a wander and seeing what we can uh, what we can find. Looks like there's car parking down that street. Lots of different shops. This one's uh, unique things to buy in there. I like that post box. So we've got coral reef fish and chips on the corner there. And then heading down there is the cocoa yard. Little burner. Looks quite interesting. Nantwich Museum. 
the town's history and all we see a little yellow pig spicy fine Indian cuisine a lot of money in Antwich just check out some of the cars here Antwich Museum, former free library built here on the site of the town jail. Designed by Thomas Bower, local architect. Become the museum in 1980. So this used to be the local jail. Into the cocoa yard. Very unusual things here. Wow. Beautiful in here. Lots of little shops. Paintings, gifts. Coach Manufactory. So during the 19th century, this chimney was part of the wheelwrights forge and smithy, making parts for horse-drawn coaches. Amazing. Very, very impressed. I guess on a weekday or a Saturday, be booming around here. Don't forget this is early Sunday morning. Always like to film early on Sunday morning. Don't get in anybody's way. And bring these beautiful places to you guys. So again, no idea where we're going. But yeah, that's the uh, the cocoa yard. All done. Looks like they're getting ready for Christmas there, or they may have never pulled a tree down, I guess. Oh no, no. No, they have got the Christmas trees up ready, look. They're a little bit early. A chop suey house, Chinese meals for takeaway. Sounds good. Amazing, the, the, all the different shops. Look at that building. Boutique bathrooms. Uh, Jepsons. We're 170, now 70 quid. Church Lane. This is Aromas. Well, it's a beautiful morning. Hardly any wind. Very, very nice. Surprising how many people are about today. It's a property here, so... Little place, 225,000. 683,000 views of the church there, 565,000. Yeah, a little place there, 137,000. That place, 1,850,000. Wow. That place, 100,000. So that was High Street that we've just uh, wandered up and around to. There's Glenn enjoying his filming in Nantwich this morning. We've got Chatwind, smells good. Looks like this one's actually an empty shop. M and Co. Closed. First empty shop I've seen. Nat West. It's amazing, all the actual banks here in Nantwich. Apart from the Barclays, still open. TSB on the corner there. They got petitions there. I think we've got the name for the video, Nantwich. Hidden treasure. So as we head further down here, Cafe Nero. Some beautiful buildings again on the on the left hand side here. Wow, let's check that one out. That's amazing. So this is the Crown Hotel here at Nantwich. Just amazing how the buildings hold up. They're all like Little Morton Orley. Cafe Nero, always busy in Cafe Nero. Edinburgh Wool Mill. And everywhere you look here, the buildings are just spectacular. Spec savers on the corner. Wow. Got the old clock on the corner there. Yeah, they definitely got all the Christmas trees up ready. It's only October. 
Time for some beautiful flowers, guys. I do like the red one. Welsh Row Shops, that way, Market Toilet, Tourist Information, St Mary's Church. Nantwich has its Turkish barbers. Turkish barbers pretty much everywhere in every little town here in the UK now. All dressed up, ready for Halloween. Pretty posh restaurants here. Ramazinos. Cleaning up, getting ready for the evening later on. That looks pretty good. Kennedy's American Diner. That'd be a good place for me. These guys have definitely got Halloween ready. There you go. You can move in straight away at some of those. There is the river. We're going to go and check that out. The town bridge, built in 1803, lies on the site of earlier bridges near to the river crossing of the Roman settlement. On the medieval bridge, first recorded in the late 14th century, there were four shops, also known as chapel dedicated to St Anne. And we're looking at the beautiful River Weaver here in Nantwich. Stunning. Look at that. And all the birds are flying down right towards us, giving us a superb view there. Nice. Looks to be more shops as we had down this way. Just past the river. Cluffs of Nantwich. So if you come to Nantwich you need to spend pretty much all day here to explore everybody. And if you like looking at shops Lots and lots of them. plenty of car parking down all these streets. But it's all paid. But again, free on a Sunday. Sunday jabbing dabber. Bar lounge club. Plenty of nightlife down here. Garlands of Nantwich. Burger place. Look at the old, uh, so that's a Cheshire cat. Hotel, restaurant and bar. Pretty expecting the window displays. All very autumn. Size of the doors there. If you're pretty tall, you'd have to duck to get in some of them. And it looks as though this is the Black Lion we're coming up to. Indian Ocean to the left is. 1664. This looks like it's the Nantwich Riverside Loop. Plenty of places around here. I well, hope you're enjoying this video walking around Nantwich this morning. Certainly glad we've chosen Nantwich today. Just beautiful. Everywhere you walk, they've got the Christmas trees up ready. It's be beautiful at Christmas time. Maybe need to do a walk around Nantwich at night. That'd be pretty cool. With all the trees. Feel the sun beating down now. Can't believe it's October. So warm at the moment. And next week, it's going to be 10 degrees cooler. Winter may arrive. Cheshire Cat, listed as being special, historic, Architectural interest. Amazing place. That little Norton Hall. No screws or anything. Putting it all together. Shot there are the Black Lion. And this is the Loco restaurant. Onto the bridge here. Over the River Weir. Now, I did read somewhere, yeah, Nantwich has got a I believe outdoor swimming pool. Pretty good shot there of the, the bridge over the weir. That is the outdoor swimming pool here at Nantwich. I guess you can't get any shots of it unless you go in there. So to the left will be the Market St Mary's Church, which is pretty much where we started off at. Super drug on the corner there. 
and a bit of a painting there thank you we got the mal bank furniture store on the corner you can hear st mary's church bringing everybody into nantwich this morning what is john b they've got a pretty unique, unique building there in nantwich Wow, so just heading back to St Mary's, heading down this street, and we've got the post office on the left hand side. Lots of estate agents around here. The post office looks pretty, pretty cool building. Marmalades. Wow. That's the first messy part of uh, Nantwich. All the bins, they need a bit of a clean up. Look at all the other shops. Wow. There's so many places to go everywhere you look. There's a different street. Entertainment exchange. A little bit of graffiti around in Nantwich, not too bad. I'm not seeing a lot of homeless people around. It is very, very clean. This is a good shop. Box and Co. For the doggies. Naked light going there. That'd be really good. Clulo Butchers. That one looks like it's closed down. Reflections. Go crew, and well, we're definitely getting close to St Mary's. Overall, I think we found our way around Nantwich quite well. Never been in here in my life. Really, really good. So that was Pepper Street that we just walked down. A lot more people out now. Check out the people in the restaurants now. It's gone 10.30. Worked up an appetite. Chatwin sausage roll. Two for 3.50, bargain. Mmm, really good. And plenty of people out. Enjoying this beautiful day. Here in Nantwich. St Mary's Church. Wow. What a wonderful day it is. Hope you're enjoying your weekend then guys. And enjoy this wonderful autumn day, warm day, here in Nantwich today. Okay, well I hope you uh, have enjoyed this wonderful walk around Nantwich today. If you have, give me a thumbs up. Drop me some comments and subscribe to the channel. And we will see you on the next adventure somewhere in the UK very soon. <laughs>